In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a multi-view drawing uh, of any part that you have made in a Onshape document. So from the main menu, I'm going to open up Activity 1.2.2, More Practice. And then in this document, you should have three tabs with these three parts. If you don't have those yet, you will need to make those at some point. But for this video, you only need to have the first one made. So from the uh, bottom tab here, I'm going to click the plus button, click insert new element, and then I'm going to click create drawing. And then a uh, window is going to pop up here and you want to make sure you click the right template. So uh, you're going to actually go down here. You should have a team called IVHS IED 2022. Click on that. And then you should only have a single template in here. It should say drawing template size A under the document column. And then just make sure no views is selected and then click OK. And that will create a new drawing for you. It might take a few seconds, but it will open up a window that looks like this. It might be zoomed in a little bit. Just use your mouse scroll wheel to kind of zoom out a little bit there. But this bottom section is called a title block and it will automatically fill in a lot of the details for you. So you'll notice your name will be in the, the name section. You'll have your teacher name. This is the size of the paper and it will have today's date. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna insert our first part or part studio one. So I'm gonna click on the little arrow and you'll see part one right here. So I'm gonna click that. And you'll notice when you move your mouse over the page, you will start to see your part and it's waiting for us to just basically click to place our front view. So make sure that your view looks like this. This will be the front of the first part. If, it, if you don't see this, then you may need to go over here under view orientation and select the side that has the actual front view for this part. But hopefully you um, have it oriented correctly. So I'm gonna just left click to place the front view. And then you'll notice your uh, cursor will still have a box around it. It is waiting for you to place the next view. So if I drag above the front view, this is where the top view would be. So I'm gonna left click again. And so now I have the front and the top, and I'm gonna have to click the front again to place the right side view. So I'm gonna click the, the front again, and then I'm just gonna drag this to the right, and there is my right side view, okay? And there's one more view that we wanna add, which is the isometric, which will go up in here. So I'm gonna left click the front again, and this time I'm gonna drag diagonally, and then you'll see the isometric view. Okay, and one more thing that we want to do is we want to shade this view. So I'm going to get out of the projected view tools. So I'm just going to go up here and left click that and then right click on uh, the isometric, go to the show hide menu and then click show shaded view. And you will see the colored and shaded version of your part. Okay, so that is how you create a drawing. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do, if you click on this little sheets button over here, I'll show you how to add in another sheet so that you can start your next drawing for your next part. So over here, this is sheet one. Notice we have that selected. If we want to make a new sheet here, uh, all you do is click this little insert sheet button at the top and it will automatically create sheet two. And then from here, uh, when you're ready to insert your next part, all you do is click this button, the insert view. I'm just going to hide the sheet menu for now. Click the insert view. And then you'll notice it has my first part selected still. Click this little drop down button, right, or actually click the insert button. And then you'll have this menu like what we had at the start. And then this time you want to go with Part Studio 2. And then insert all of the views uh, the same way that I showed you uh, before. 